Hey guys, it's the Coaster Bellman here with an awesome video. The Six Flags Great Adventure Decade Plan from 2017 to 2026. I think in 2017 they should add the Justice League Dark Ride and a Larson Super Loop. These are two great additions that have been in Six Flags par Parks recently. If this park added both, that would be pretty awesome. In 2018, I would expect a family ride package or a Huss Topspin. Is Six Flags Great Adventure does not have any flat rides besides their Drop Tower, Zoom and Jar Drop of Doom, and Winds and their Sky Screamer ride. Another thrill ride would really improve their lineup of thrill and dark rides with the Justice League Dark Ride and the Topspin. And for 2019, I would expect a double out and back Woody. There's some lands, land by the park that's all trees. They can just tear down the trees and make an, a double out and back woody, which would be pretty nice. And for 2020, they should add some animals to Safari Off-Road Adventure. And for 2020, 2021, they should do a revamp of their old Batman the Ride BN and Invert. It's not old. But it's a middle-aged coaster. Like, if they revamped it, like, the one at Six Flags Magic Mountain, kind of, with the color, new color scheme with blue and black supports, that would be awesome for Batman and the Ride at Six Flags Great Adventure, because Batman and the Ride at Six Flags Great Adventure does not have a great color scheme at all. 2022, I wouldn't expect anything major. Probably prepare land for the new 2023 coaster, which would be a B&M Giga Coaster, kind of like Leviathan or Fury 325. This would be awesome for Six Flags Great Adventure because they don't have a coaster in between 300 and 400 feet. And for 2024, they should add another thrill related ride, a Huss Frisbee. Now they would have two Huss rides, a Drop Tower, a Sky Screamer, and a Dark Ride. That would be a great throw and dark ride lineup. And for 2025, they should add a Zamperla Disco, which is a pretty interesting ride that's at some Cedar Fair parks, and some new animals for the Safari Off-Road Adventure, which would be some solid addition. And for 2026, a brand new water park with admission. Six Flags Great Adventure does not have a water park, but it would be sweet if they could build a new water park. That would just bring in tons of guests to Six Flags Great Adventure, and it would improve the park easily. And that's my decade plan of Six Flags Great Adventure. Stay tuned for more videos.